if I don't, I don't have this the, the, the moment with this to concentrate, to feeling, and I start to, because I have problems with my wife for money or for other things, or I have problems with my with children because school of their <coughs> and but I ha and if I have a family very good here it's it's a good family for me because don't 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 make me more preoccupations worries worries and I can pay and I have days and weeks and months with no problems and I have peace interrupt peace and this is a, uh, it's, it's all that made me, I can pay. My wife support, my voice, no problems. And it is, it's, a, it's a nice place for me. The city here, Querétaro, is, is, is good for me because I have a, look, I have a good life. Um, people, no more, people, no more problems. And all of this made me that I'm happy to paint. And I enjoy to paint. And I paint that I want to paint. And I said that I want to, I, I, I something that I enjoy, no something that I have to pay to sell. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> so what I heard you say is that your, both your family and where you live helps inspire Inspired, yes. your painting. Is that correct? Yes. It's a, it's all. with other coaches and with the football players and I was like that shout. shout and be adrenaline say I would say adrenaline it's the same the be yourself yes uh, yes and, and that's good for me because I'm in the field I sprout and I come here and I can concentrate it's it's a, a good combination that made me feel very fortunate sí. with my life. Sí. What happens to you when you see something, either a picture or a person, or what happens that says, I'm going to go home and paint that? <laughs> what happens I, inside you? I, I don't know in words to describe this moment, but I really, it was emotional. Feel excited. Excited about when I saw pictures and and feel something, and it's the same feeling that when I start to paint, and the pain say me, yes, you do it. That's nice. Do you want? I I, I think I feel that, and I see the the time when I say I have to stop, stop, or I have to move more, and another color. And it's going to, it's a moment, special moment, 
because no have time, no have I I, I, no, I don't know. I put music to feel, but I I saw I I know when I paint it, someone told me I, and I don't hear because I'm in trance. So I say it is this. It's a, it's a it's a a feeling that it, it, I think that is a feeling that made me that I return to pain and two or three weeks I have one to pain but I want to feel that I want to need to feel that and in in the, in the football it's more similar I'm going to begin the game I'm going to kick off and you feel like this and, oh, and all uh, yes the leaf I and it's the same thing but in the pain, you have to be careful that no explodes and you have to move, to move. And when you feel that, oh, I have it, it's, it's a nice it's a moment. Yes, very. So, <clears throat> of all the things, these paintings here in your home, how many, how often do you s sit down to paint something and you finish the same day? Uh, it's, I will, it's something that I make a lot. I, I paint and I want to finish in that same day when it's something with a lot of passion, with a lot of feeling. And it's, it's, it's a reason that much people say to me, why do you not paint more? Because it, if you, if you, if you, you, want to, you, you can't paint in one day, but you paint all the days and you have 300 paints. But the feeling is only this day and the moment and when I finish I feel tired, tired. Yes. Uh, because my pain uh, gives a lot of emotion, it's emotional pain mm -hmm. like, and when I pain I, I uh, tire, I get tired, get tired. Get tired. Yeah. yeah. And if I paint something that no made me this feeling like um some encargo, I paint some, somebody gave they me please paint me this and I paint I make some of these tricks, watercolor special tricks, but it's not something to come from me to I want that, I, I want to paint that. And it's, it's different. And maybe in this kind of paintings, I can paint in two or three weeks. Right. Yes, but.
if someone was getting married in a few weeks, but they want to have a portrait painted by you of the bride and the groom. Let's say the father of the bride wants a watercolor painting of his daughter in her wedding dress. Do they, must the daughter come here to your studio and sit for you? Or can they just simply send you a photo? I, what do you prefer? I prefer that, I, I kind of prefer to paint with a good photo. But it's better for me that, give, that she give me a lot of photo, much for to, I understand more yes. of this. And if, I know him is better because I have to have all of elements to give me the exactly. Yes, the, I understand. The, 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 well the, said. So, my understanding is, is that when President AMLO was uh, elected President of Mexico, that the state of Queretaro contacted you to paint a horse? No, no it's AMLO, it's another, it's Fox. Fox, Vincente Fox. Fox. When Mr. Fox was elected president, the state of Queretaro came to you and asked you to paint a horse for him. Yes. This is true. Yes. And do you know where that painting is today? Yeah, I think that the painting is in a museum that President Vicente Fox made in his in Guanajuato. Yeah. And with all of the gifts the yeah. people give. In like the presidential library. Yes, I, yes. I, I, I'm, I think that it's, it's going to be there. Okay, now when we look out in the next 24 months, okay, um, what are some things you would like to do with your painting that you haven't done yet? Is there anything you would like to do, like paint waterfalls, paint mountains, paint famous people, paint young women on their 16th birthday, okay? For their, forgive my Espanol, the quesinera, okay? Or a bride and groom, or a dedication to a new, beautiful building, and they want a very large watercolor in their main lobby. Can you talk about these things? Yes, I, I, I know that what I want in a few years, I can travel with my plane. I like a lot to go to make workshops, and it's it's nice for me. It's a very what's it divertido? Fun. 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 That go with a lot of people, with much people that stay in this moment in the show in a workshop to learn and to have a nice moment. A lot of people when when you want to make a workshop, all of the artists that is stay there, have a positive energy. And this is good for me, it's a magical moment because 
if you paint something, oh, that's beautiful. And all, all wants to be beautiful, his pain and, and energy positive, and it's, it's, it's a nice three or four days in a workshop to, how do you say, to the energy, to feel, feel good. And all of these is the question that why I made that or who do you do made that made me a uh, grown. Yes, uh, you to... you become a better yes. artist during these yes. workshops yes. because there's an exchange of ideas okay. yes. between yourself and the people attending yes. the workshop. <laughs> And it's a very powerful creative energy. Yes, I like this. And I, I want to. In Okay, Olga, can you talk to Bill about your husband's gift of painting and what it means to you? Well, I think that he has a special gift because since he was very young, he always was uh, drawing. For example, you can see his um, notebooks, and he don't have a lot of uh, uh, part of the class, but he has a lot of drawings. Or sometimes he makes some a lot of drawings uh, about the the, the 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 class, or the teachers, or whatever. He always uh, was drawn. Also, uh, I I appreciate very much what my uh, mother-in-law did because he never told him to not, not to draw. He always let him be free uh, uh, to be drawing, because sometimes this is what people do. Oh, don't, be, don't draw. Uh, stop drawing, uh, start, uh, start uh, having attention in the class. So we cut the children this, this initiative, this creative, uh, and well, this is the, the way we, we lose this, this part. So they, all, they always let him free, be free, and they let him choose the, what he want to study. Then he, he went to study in the, in the college, and he, he studied graphic design. But then they didn't press him to, to go to work or, or do anything like this. And he, they let, let, let them know, let them uh, uh, keep um, learning. So he decided to, to, to have lessons in sculpture and then he went to Guadalajara. But before he uh, went to went draw, he always let him be free uh, uh, to be drawing, because sometimes this is what people do. Oh, don't, be, don't draw. Uh, stop drawing, uh, start, uh, start uh, having attention in the class. So we cut the children this, this initiative, this creative, uh, and well, this is the, the way we, we lose. This, this part. So they, all, they always let him free, be free, and they let him choose the, what he wants to study. Then he, he went to study in the, in the college, and he, he studied graphic design. But then they didn't press him to, to go to work or, or do anything like this. And he, they let, let, let them know, let them uh, uh, keep um, learning. So he decided to, to, to have lessons in sculpture, and then he went to Guadalajara. But before he uh, went, went to Guadalajara, this teacher, this Alfredo's teacher, saw some of the drawings because he made me a drawing of my face, a portrait to me, and he gave it to me. So I hang it in, in the wall in my house. So this, this painter, this 
uh, artist came to my house and saw, oh, he, who did this draw to you? Oh, it was Alfredo, he's my boyfriend. Oh, he, he has a, a natural gift because he, he, he draws very natural. He can see any, anything and draw it naturally. So he told me, oh, he has a special gift. So I, I want to give him the opportunity to come to my school and I will help him and support him to have lessons there because he has the ability and he has to, to learn. He, he don't know the technique, the watercolor technique, but he can learn it because he has this gift for drawing and for see, for see shadows and lights. and So this is a special gift. So he, then he went to Guadalajara and he took some, some lessons with this teacher and until now he always support him and watch his paintings and, and, he, and give him a lot of feedback. Because sometimes when you're, you start growing like an artist, nobody tells you anything that, like you're wrong or you're good. So he always liked to go back with his teacher and, and have, have some feedback. Also, when, when he's uh, drawing, it's, it's incredible when you see that he, he select a picture and he, he builds the image or what he's going to do in his mind. Because when he starts working, he really, if you compare it against water, uh, oil painting, for example, you can see that artists in oil painting take a lot of weeks and months. He, he paints very fast, but I, I think that he has everything in his mind, and this is what is his uh, special gift. He has everything set in his mind, and when he starts uh, painting, he has everything solved, and he knows what is he's going to, to bring. And he, if he don't, didn't make it in the first time, Probably he, he throw it again and, th and start again because he has, he has everything there and he know what, he's, what he want to get from the, this, this work. Yeah. So this is what I, I can think that is the special gift he has. He, mm -hmm. he can, like, like the place in the football, he know here before the, he start painting what he wants to have in the, in the painting. So okay. this is what I think. As his wife, mm -hmm. um, what what does your husband's gift mean to you as a woman? What does it mean to you as his wife? Do you understand how I can tell it's a wonderful thing to witness a man and a woman deeply in love like you two are and you respect one mm -hmm. another. Um, but not every woman is married <laughs> to a watercolor maestro. Yes. What does this mean to Olga? Well, he, he means a lot of, uh, to me in different aspects of my, on my life. And the first thing is that he, when we get married, well, he's a support for me. And also he's my balance because we have different personalities and I think that Together we are the balance, yes? yes. Because uh, we understand through the years that we are different, very different. Mm -hmm. So this is our, our, the, the key of our success because we are balanced and we support each other on the different needs we have. So if I don't have anything, something, he will support me with this part and, and, and both ways. Mm -hmm. so, so everything when I, when, when I need him, he's there for me. And yeah. he's, this is the, the more valuable thing. Also, well, he's a great um, example for my kids yes. because he's uh, the most uh, honorable person. Mm -hmm. He's the most honest person. And um, he, you know, he, he don't drink, he, he exercises a lot. So, well, he's the, first, the, very, um, the, the best person to be a father. Yes. Yes. Yes, that's excellent. Mm -hmm. uh, also, well, uh, he support me a lot when when he take kids to to the field mm -hmm. because all the afternoons they go with him, and I'm able to to work, to work. and yeah. to be. I'm, uh, he give me the opportunity to be successful in my job because yeah. I have uh, plenty of time to invest in my in my job. So now, this you, is this is great. You and Alfredo met in Mexico City at the university, and, the university. Mm -hmm. and uh, 
you dated were boyfriend and girlfriend for <laughs> 10 years. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I should also note here, because we're talking into a recorder, that Olga, when she was answering my last question, she got tears in her <laughs> eyes because of how proud she is to be the wife of this man, the mother to these two wonderful sons, and to have the blessing of the family support and love that she enjoys today. Mm -hmm. um, so, Alfredo, what has your wife meant mm -hmm. to you in regard to your painting gift over the years? Because many artists today, and in historically, many artists have not had the blessing of a supportive wife. How has Olga been important to you? Yes, uh, in English, I want to, I say in English, I try to <laughs> talk in English. Yes, <laughs> yeah. right. oh, it's, it's very important. It's, if she don't be my wife, I can make anything because one of the uh, uh, important things is the money. And, <clears throat> and when I start to paint, my teacher say that me that if I can pay, paint with, uh, for me, not to sell. When, when I paint, I think that I paint something that like me. It's is a it's a. It's a blessing. It's a blessing. But if I have to paint something to sell, and yeah. when I sell and when I paint, I think. I going to sell this, and I, because I have need, need the, I need the money, and and, and in this time I, I be an artesan, como se dice artesano? It's a, well, a people who who make to 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 want to sell, and the feeling that you have. You make you. And you, you are like a machine. Yeah, like a machine. You, you reproduce your work because you have to to, to need money. And this is uh, the support of, of Olga with his work, with his money, with, with, his, with his, his, no, her, her. <laughs> este, bueno, it, it give me the tranquilidad, what say? Bueno, the past, the... Peace. The, peace. the peace. Mm -hmm. To paint, I want to, to paint, and I start sell the things that I paint for me, that I paint for my enjoy. enjoy. Yeah. And this is grateful because a lot of, it, that is the first reason that a lot of artists don't grow because they need to, to sell. Right. And now it's, it's, a, it's good for me. And another thing that is very important for an artist is I think the interior piece. If I don't, I don't have this the, the the moment with peace to concentrate, to feeling, and I start to because I have problems with my wife for money or for other things, or I have problems with my with children because the school of their <coughs> and but I ha, and if I have a family very how say uh, it's, it's a good family for me because don't 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 make me more preoccupations, worries, worries, worries. and I campaign and I have days and weeks and months with no problems and I have peace, interior peace, and this is a uh, it's it's all that made me I campaign. My wife support, my boys no problems, and this is it's a it's a nice place for me. The city here, Querétaro, is. is is good for me because have a, look, a good light. Um, people no more. People no more problems, and all of this made me that I'm happy to paint, and I enjoy to paint, and I paint that I want to paint, and I sell that I want to. I, I, I something that I enjoy, not something that I have to pay to sell. That's it. Yeah.
powerless. <coughs> so what I heard you say is that your both your family and where you live helps inspire Inspired, yes. your painting. Is that correct? Yes, it's a it's all of this. I have good friends. I I teach. I I'm coach football. I, a football coach that when I go to the field, I have a good relationships with other coaches and with the football players, and I coach guitar, shout and be adrenaline. Say, Adre I say adrenaline. Well, the same. With the be yourself. Yes. Uh, yes. And, and that's good for me because in, in the field, I sprout and I come here and I can concentrate. It's, it's a, a good combination that made me feel very fortunate, afortunado? Fortunate. fortunate with my life. See, what, what happens to you when you see something, either a picture or a person or what happens that says, I'm going to go home and paint that? <laughs> What happens I, inside you? I, I don't know in words to describe this moment, but I really, uh, what is it, emotional? Feel but excited. Excited about when I saw a picture of, and, and feel something. And it's the same feeling that when I start to paint, and the pain say me, yes, you do it. That's nice. Do you want? I I I think I feel that, and it's the the time when I say I have to stop, stop, or I have to move more, and another color, and it's going to it's a moment, special moment, because no have time, no have I I I no I don't know I put music to feel, but I I saw I I know when I paint it. Someone told me, I, and I don't hear because I'm in, in trance. So I'm say this, this and it's it's a it's a, a feeling that it, it, I, I think that this is a feeling that made me that I return to pain. And two or three weeks, I have want to paint. But I want to feel that. I want to need to feel that. And in in, a, in the football. It's more similar when going to begin the game and going to kick off, and you feel like this. Oh, I all uh, yes, the leaf. I and it's the same thing, but in the pain you have to be careful that no explodes. And you have to move to move, and when you feel that, oh, I have it. It's. It's a nice just, uh, moment. Yes, very satisfying. Yes, yes, <laughs> very satisfying. Yes. So, <clears throat> of all the things, these paintings here in your home, how many, how often do you s sit down to paint something and you finish the same day? Uh, it's I, it's something that I make a lot. I I paint and I want to finish in that same day. When it's something with a lot of passion, with a lot of feeling, and it's 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 a reason that m much people say to me, why do you not paint more? Because it, if you pay, you want you you want to you you can paint in one day. You paint all the days, and you have 300 paints. But the feeling is only in this day and the moment. And when I finish, I me siento cansado. I feel tired. 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 Yes. Uh, because my pain uh, give a lot of emotion. It's emotional pain. Mm -hmm. I give, and when I paint, I. I uh, I, I, I get tired. Get tired. Yeah. Yeah. And if I paint something that not made me this feeling like um, 
Me hizo un encargo. A paint. Some, somebody gave me, they, they paid me this. And I paint. I make some of these tricks, watercolor, special tricks. But it's not something to come for me. To I want that. I, I want to paint that. And it's, it's different. And maybe in this kind of paintings, I can paint in two or three weeks. Right. Yes, but... So, if someone was getting married in a few weeks, but they want to have a portrait painted by you of the bride and the groom, mm -hmm. let's say the father of the bride wants a watercolor painting of his daughter in her wedding dress. Do they, must the daughter come here to your studio and sit for you, or can they just simply send you a photo? I, what do you prefer? I prefer that, I, I have a prefer to paint with a good photo, but it's better for me that, give, that she give me a lot of photo, much for to, I understand more of this, and if, I know him is better because I have to have all of elements to give me the exactly yes uh, I thing. understand yes. well yes. said so my understanding is is that when President Amlo was uh, elected president of Mexico that the state of Querétaro contacted you to paint a horse? No, no, it's AMLO, it's another, it's Fox. Fox, Vincente, Fox. Vincente, Vincente Fox. Fox. When Mr. Fox was elected president, the state of Queretaro came to you and asked you to paint a horse for him. Yeah. This is true. Yes. And do you know where that painting is today? Yeah, I think that the painting is in a museum that President Vicente Fox made in his in Guanajuato. Yeah. And with all of the gifts that yeah. people give. It's like the presidential library. Yes. I, yes. I, I, and I think that is <clears throat> going to be there. Okay. Now, when we look out in the next 24 months, okay, um, what are some things you would like to do with your painting that you haven't done yet? Is there anything you would like to do, like paint waterfalls, paint mountains, paint famous people, paint young women on their 16th birthday, Okay, for their, forgive my Espanol, their quesinera, okay, <laughs> or a bride and groom, or a dedication to a new beautiful building and they want a very large watercolor in their main lobby. Can yeah. you talk about these things? Yes, I... I, I know that what I want in a few years, I can travel with my paint. I like a lot to go to make workshops, and it's it's nice for me. It's, it's a very what's it divertido, at, at este, fun. fun that go with a lot of people, with much people that stay in this moment in the show in a workshop to learn and to have a nice moment. All the people, when, when you go to make a workshop, all of the artists that stay there have a positive energy. And this is good for me. It's, it's a magical moment because if you paint something, oh, that's beautiful. And all, all wants to be beautiful, his pain and, and energy positive and it's, it's, it's a nice three or four days in a workshop to 
¿cómo se dice? Este, llenarte de energía, to feel, feel good. And all of these este, questions that, why I made that, or who do you do made that, made me a uh, grown. Yes, you, to, you become a better yes. artist during these yes. workshops yes. because there's an exchange of ideas okay. yes. between yourself and yes. the people attending yes. the workshop <coughs> and it's <coughs> a very powerful creative energy. Yes, I like this. Uh, and I, I want in, in a few years, I, I can make this not only in Mexico, I want to travel to another country and try to make that same. I I, I love a lot of uh, biennales, you know the uh, concursos, contests, and all the world. Then in the first day, in the opening, in the opening, maybe two or three days before we can make demonstraciones. Demonstration. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I like that. And the other, uh, the, the other thing I, I want to do is to make better watercolors in aprovechando, taking advantage. taking advantage of all the new uh, techniques. techniques and new papers and all of these new things that make me make that you can make better watercolors in much bigger and much bright and more este, contemporary, more modernas, you know, that. Yeah. And I want to make that, uh, mm -hmm. to, to paint, if, we go to, if I want to paint portraits, I want to make better portraits day of day, day and with more este, creative, Things yeah. uh, it's, it's the thing that I, if I paint uh, landscapes or things, I I I wants to. Uh, each time. Each time that I paint something different, I make I be better uh, painting. I don't want to paint the same for the, because it's sure. No, I want to. Advance. Advance. You, you yes. are always challenging yes. yourself yes. to become a better artist, yes. to adopt emerging techniques, yes. adopt new uh, colors, uh, new see. types of watercolor, uh, yeah. new papers, Paper, new surfaces so, yes. to express yourself yes. on. Is yes. this correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I, I want to add something, uh, Bill, if you uh, allow me. Once it happens, something really very nice because a Mexican, I think that, that he is a Mexican watercolor artist, saw Alfredo's painting, and probably he can tell you more about this story because I don't remember it very Angel good. Mauro. Angel Mauro, the, the artist, watercolor artist, saw his painting, and he's really not very well known in Mexico, he's very famous. And he, he, he saw his paintings and he told him that, oh, I think you, you, are, you can do something different because I can see your, your work. Please don't uh, stay there and don't keep doing the same. Please uh, express yourself in different yourself, ways. Or probably he, ha he can explain you better. Uh, he, can, he, he was the, ¿cómo se llama? jurado. He was a jury. jury. He was a jury in a contest. Yeah. And he was he, a judge. Yes, judge. Mm -hmm. And they and he gave me the second place. And when I finished the contest, he come to me come here. His name is Angel Mauro. It's a it's an excellent watercolor. He died, and but when I it, it, he, but he said to me, you can paint. Uh, bigger uh, watercolors, and you try, to, you buy paper in roll and make bigger things. You don't, I, I don't give you the first place because you paint something 
eh, ¿cómo se ha parecido? Similar. Similar than the next year. The past year. The past year. And you have to grow. And it's the reason that I don't give you the first. But you have to, to do that, to paint in big one. And I say, why did you don't paint in big one? And I say me big to moments. me. And he say me, because I'm old and I can do that. But you can do that. And uh, please make it. And I, I, I begin to paint in this big format. And it's nice for me. It's, when, it's difficult. It's, it's more see, difficult to, to, control to, the yeah, to control the water and to water colors are this paint this size. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's nice for me. And, it's, and uh, I feel good when I paint faces like this in this mm -hmm. format. It's, it's very nice. I, I agradezco, ¿cómo se dice? Um, I appreciate very much. I appreciate very much that Angel Maro said me that, and this is the the that I want to do that. I to to keep growing. To keep growing. Okay. Last question is, what would you like to say to your beautiful wife today for all her love and support throughout <laughs> the years? What would you like uh, to say? Only thanks. Thanks to stay with me in all of these moments of our life uh, we are what well, I appreciate uh, she support me and understand me because uh, it's something like it's our family it's only for you for two my brother my friends uh, a lot of people near us, it's difficult to understand that we can make this complicit relationship. relation that she can work and I can take, take care, care of the child family. and she give money and I can paint and this for me it's a perfect life for me because I made yes. that I want with the girl that know I, I know him her, her <laughs> when, when he has her has 18 years and all the days I say that is it's a bit for me that no okay him. when when Bill says last question he is lying to you because there's always one more question. <laughs> so here is the last question. The last question is, what, well, let me put it this way. <clears throat> My wife and I, we moved to Mexico permanente, and I am a photographer, a writer, and a journalist. And wow, there are so many things in Mexico as an artist that are so inspiring to me that it is not present in Estados Unidos. Some of those things are, of course, beautiful people, wonderful colors, uh, food <laughs> and tastes that I love, and new places to explore, and artists like yourself. So when it comes to young artists in Mexico, what is your inspirational message to those young artists in Mexico? I, I think that they have to be, how do you say, Excuse me, excuse me. Cuando son realmente authentic, authentic, because the artists or the paint or the moving artists move have a lot of fakes, teachers fakes, uh, artists, artists, and. A, a lot of 
poses, ¿cómo se poses? Bueno, They're just like acting like acting like artists, and I think that I I I say that they stay authentic and enjoy like me that that you do, no do something to like his teacher or or to self, and if you don't feel that you don't make you don't be a, an artist. Right. If you want to, what I heard you say, forgive me for interrupting, is express yourself and enjoy it. Don't try to impress other people. Yes, that, uh, don't try to to make the uh, to parecer to look like look like an artist because your hair is long, long or because you don't you dress like your dress be dirty of you spoke with words and anybody understand and this is not an artist and, and but, but a lot of people a lot of students think that oh it's it's an artist, a really artist and I say that no because my uh, experience my experience is totally different I play football and when I and I finished to play football. I go to the class to draw a model, a nude model, and no problem. And I hit, and then I draw. I draw, and it's the same when now I coach and show shout in the shout. guitar shout. shout shout in the guitar shout. in the field, and I come to my house to my studio and play. And I don't have to have uh, etiquetas or ¿cómo se dice? Stereotypes. 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 That an Aries. And, and I think that it's more important this. A lot of people that paint now are painting the cows, the dead. That something like this, but you, you know that they live Fine, they have money, but they try to paint that the poor people feel. And